Hello guys, what's up? In today's video, I have rounded up what I think are the best 65-inch TVs of this year. To see the most up-to-date prices and find out more information about these TVs, you can check out the links in the description below. Let's get started. The very first TV from the list is from the quality player Samsung QN90A, Best QLED. With a glance, we see the chic stylish look, but I won't go without mentioning that Samsung is capable of creating a more superior and luxurious feel with the look. Instead, they decided to put superior extra coin. But thank godness, the bezels are as too slim, making the screen look infinite. All the cables are managed in the back and is ready to be mounted on the wall if you want to spice up the decoration of your room. The newest Samsung models are called Neo QLED and the added Quantum Matrix technology has a small LED in it. It is packed with full array local dimming, which means every zone can be adjusted independently. Besides, the 4K display with Quantum HDR 24X is where vibrant colors pop out from the screen to your eyes in an intensive luminance range. No more fighting for the seat with the wide view angle feature because each detail can be seen from any side of the sofa, plus it minimizes the distraction from the sunlight with an anti-reflective coating. Being a great tool for gaming too, the TV is running at a 120Hz refresh rate with Motion Accelerator Turbo Plus to deliver you the best picture with an exceptional improvement in quality and value. Every sound and movement is tracked to make you feel full enjoyment. Ask more from your TV by using the Virtual Assistant Alexa to help you choose your playlist, newly released movies, open and close the app, and much more. You just have to call out her name and she's ready to help. Pros. Incredibly bright, chic look, Quantum HDR 24X feature. Whereas for the cons, Expensive, lower color contrast for OLED screen. Let's put up a smoke screen with this incredible TV from LG G1, best OLED. With its high-end appearance, the G1 looks stunning on the wall or the TV unit. The strong structure is followed by ultra slim bezels with tapered edges, which I believe are intended to be hung. Because it does not come with a stand, you will need to purchase the feed independently. That is kind of regrettable. The 4K OLED EVO panel and LG's 65-inch screen provides a some bright viewing experience. By providing over 8 million correct hues in purity, it answers all of the potential tough issues that you are concerned about. The OLED panel, of course, differs from conventional screens in that its pixels are self-lit, and as a result, it does not use a limited backlighting technology. As a result, any hue is rendered with a higher level of realism. The A9 Gen 4 AI processor employs algorithms to automatically determine a style or category of art, music, and movie scenes and manages to obtain the best quality no matter what genre you're watching to accomplish the intended fit. Dolby Vision IQ intelligently adjusts visual settings to match any environment, while Dolby Atmos is ready to excite and make you feel like you're there. Stay closely since your favorite team is set to play, and you won't be able to miss it because it broadcasts forthcoming matches across multiple channels. The NFL, NBA, MLB, NHL, Premier League, and a lot more are available. Upgrade your gaming mode with FreeSync and G-Sync support and play the fast-paced games at a frame rate of 120Hz. Be present at lifelike accurate colors on the screen with sync graphics and upgrade yourself to the next level, please. Pros. FreeSync and G-Sync support, stunning screen and fast response time. Whereas for the cons, kind of expensive, bass sound is not so qualitative and no stand in the box. I feel like there's more hyping should be done in this next TV from the list. It's the Sony X90J, best for gaming. Coming sleek and stylish design, Sony is convincing you in putting up some cash immediately after seeing it. The smooth and glossy screen is followed by thin borders that are almost invisible. The standard V-shaped legs don't follow the good look unfortunately. They could have become with a better solution I guess. Besides, you can't position it any closer. I'm just sharing this because you will need wider space and it will disappoint if you plan to use it in a smaller TV unit. Being the normalized LED LCD technology, the 4K resolution will full around local dimming backlight reflects every zone of the screen independently for better color contrast. Being the normalized LED LCD technology, the 4K resolution with full array local dimming backlight reflects every zone of the screen independently for better color contrast, which is an essential tool for the image to be seriously qualitative. We can also see a notable improvement in the native refresh rate of 120Hz. Now gaming experience is more than its necessary or desirable level. The cognitive processor XR is 
is aware of the human vision and manages to deliver the appreciating contrast with pure blacks, grid peak brightness, and neutral shades to calm your eyes. Followed by the XR True Luminous Pro feature, recaptures the most precise colors inside of the billion impressive image intensity. Watch quality movies with quality core provided by Bravia where it allows you to bring the cinema home. Google TV services offer over 700,000 plus movies and TV shows from across the world to let you find your favorite streaming. Here comes Netflix, Amazon Prime Video, Disney Plus, YouTube, the Apple TV app to let you figure this out. Lastly, we have our little princess Alexa to assist us in everything. She's here to cheer us up when we need her. Pros. Colors are highly balanced, handles the motion very well, and solid build. Whereas for the cons, limited blacks, narrow view angles, and mediocre sound. The list will look incomplete if I didn't add this TV by LG NanoCell 80, best value. NanoCell 80 has a nice thin build quality with a minimalist design. It may not have a premium look like other models, but it's quite decent. Having slight thick bezels and the feet on the sides that are made out of metal. The stand supports the TV very well without wobbling too much and the space between feet is allowing you to put a soundbar by providing enough space because it is placed in the edges of the TV. It is based on a real 4K nanocell screen using a basic non-HDR component. The images appear to achieve great color contrast and accuracy thanks to the quad-core processor that secures a pure and crisp view. Local dimming brings to light deep blacks and stabilizes lighting and with the nano color, now you can see vibrant images that can be reached to a billion shades of colors. Think you LG smart devices can be controlled by other devices like smartphones, laptops, or tablets directly to your TV. The Magic Remote Voice is in charge of Google Assistant and Alexa to give you full control by using the voice only. Speaking of that, tell your virtual assistant to access Netflix, Prime Video, YouTube, Apple TV+, Disney+, and LG channels to help you find the trendy movies and TV shows even in foreign languages. The Filmmaker Mode will make you feel like the cinema is brought here in your house. You can play some real games here as well. 60Hz of refresh rate with game optimizer mode found in the settings will help you to lower the input lag. Auto -lay low latency mode and dynamic gaming of HGIG gives you the full get up and go. It's great value for the price you pay and will be at your service for long years ahead. Pros, low input lag, handles reflection well and wide view angles. Whereas for the cons, poor HDR, doesn't support local dimming and thick borders. Get this TV for a song by Vizio M Series, best budget. Vizio is showing that the brand itself can perform as well as better known brands by offering more affordable price points. Okay, now moving on to the look. Having an almost identical design from previous models, it stands in a standard basic build that will add the finished touch to your living room. The bezels on the edges are slim, but the bottom one where the logo is embedded is slightly thick. The V-shaped feet and back made out of metal are making the TV more practical. It is highlighted with a 4K Ultra HD display that holds out over 8 million colors. Pixels reach the peak brightness with active pixel uh, tuning adjustments. The inner part includes a lighting fast IQ active processor that delivers higher ranking image processing during your commands. Vizio's next generation quantum color is ready to give you the most beautiful vivid colors while you are fully concentrated on your favorite TV show. Th select the best movies in streaming platforms such as Netflix, Disney+, YouTube, and many more from the TV using the SmartCast mobile app. The remote is also smart. Press the button and let the Vizio voice make your life easier by opening apps and channels, turning on and off the TV, and so on. Running at a 60Hz native refresh rate, still this TV manages to take gaming to a different level because it supports the FreeSync VRR feature, which is so rare for the TV at this price. It has a low input lag and low latency toggle with such dark calibrated images. Vizio maintains a great price point and its screen accuracy as well. Hopefully next time they will make a couple of changes in the look and black uniformity. Maybe adding local dimming or something, I don't know. Pros. Excellent 4K screen, handles reflection, low input lag and freezing VRR support. Whereas for the cons, blacks look like grayish narrow angles of view, and SDR or HDR does not get bright enough. Alright guys, with that being said, thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video to be helpful. If you have any questions about the products mentioned in this video, you can leave a comment down below and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Until the next video, stay safe, take care, and peace out.